So, so yeah, stress is a big one. Stress and toxicity are probably the two that we didn't that we didn't touch so let's on. Let's them quick. So with him, real quick, stress. I mean, you got to manage stress. So stress could be emotional. The people stress. listening here probably have some stress. Yeah. I mean, entrepreneurs. You yeah. said you came from that hundred percent commission environment. Yeah. So did I, and that is yeah. a stressful environment right. to come from. So like for me, I got home from work at seven. I put a deal together. I kissed my my kids good night, and then I was ready just to chill. I'd either play video games, watch a documentary. I'd work out in the morning. So at night right. it was like my oh, I deserved it. Right. It's now my time. Right. My time included six tacos, you yeah, know, or whatever. Right? right, you're gonna eat stuff that doesn't isn't good for you because it makes you feel good. Right, it placates all the stress you've had throughout the day, and you deserve it. Right, and you deserve it night after night after night, and right. pound after pound after pound. Right, and you look back and go, "How did I gain thirty pounds over COVID?" Well, instead of going out and working out and doing your hobbies, you chose to use that as an excuse to sit and eat right. and drink, which right. most people did. Hundred percent. You can be offended by what I say, but I'm noticing a lot of people are big right now. Right. Well, it's and, pretty. It's, it's crazy. And, and whether you want to be healthy, perform well, or lose weight, stress and toxicity play a huge role. So there's a lot of people that work their ass off, they eat pretty well, and they can't quite lose weight. And it's generally because of their stress, their stress responses and stress hormones are out of whack, and then toxicity. So, for example. There's a lot of women, especially probably more than men who have a lot of water retention and they can't get as lean as they want to get. And a lot of times it's toxicity based. Mm. So it could be different things from nature, beauty products, whatever, but there's so much toxicity that we bring in. That Your body huge, won't release it. Yeah. They won't release, so it's a huge issue. So then stress is not just stress from work, stress from relationship stress, like the, the type of stress that we think of, emotional stress. Stress is much deeper than that. So uh, toxicity is stress to our body. Chronic infections are stress to our body. So a ton of people have chronic infections, parasites, fungal yeast. I mean, you bacterial, you name it, low grade underlying infections that are wreaking havoc on their body. And so somebody like me who had a lot of food sensitivities and weird, like autoimmune type stuff, I've studied this a lot and I've tried to get to the bottom of it. And so from time to time, I'll do different like antimicrobial, um, protocols, which will potentially uh, kill or clear infections, mm -hmm. you, you know, like you just, people have 